Be sure to thoroughly research the advantages of setting up in recognised industrial zones. The reason we chose this region is because uh, it's a mature industrial zone, which means you know, a lot of uh, good policies and uh, well-organised uh, uh, government officials already here. That's give us, give us a lot of efficient help. NDA's uh, factory in Jiading is in an industrial zone. Uh, that zone's uh, quite well developed. Um, there's a mixture of light and uh, heavy manufacturing scattered around the region. Um, and the local governments work very hard to actually attract manufacturers to that zone. Um, yeah, we have access to the, all the resources and things we need there. So we've got good access to motorways and roading and things in there. In my opinion, in China, you should not go outside any of the recognised zones. The recognised zones are managed by professional people. They want investment into West China, so they are going to provide um, uh, additional incentives for companies to go and invest out there to develop that part of the country. Being in an industrial zone would be much easier because a lot of the support services are supplied by the zone and you only pay for them. Um, where we are, we have to dispose of our own sewage and we have to also obtain our own water, which we're taking out of a bore. So we have to look after a bore pump. And so we have all these other little things we have to manage. And we deal with a small local town council who are very political. Those people have their own KPIs that they have to achieve. Um, they make a lot of promises they never deliver. Um, they're politicians. Where most people are focusing on the seaboard uh, big uh, cities, and that's where a lot of international companies are going. There are very few companies that are prepared to come out and work in the rural areas as uh, foreign companies. Now, that, for, from a Chinese point of view, is, is a high priority area, and we just happen to be uh, undertaking such activities. It's case by case for your industry, etc. There might be small satellite cities outside Shanghai or Beijing, which says we are for designers, we are for architects, we are for this, and they try, try and create an infrastructure around those industries. The three things to do with location is the infrastructure around you, the support structure in terms of engineering, uh, spare parts, supply, everything around you. Logistics, that's moving into, into you, the raw materials are moving away from you, and, and, and staff. And, and those three dictate where you should go.